Hi everyone, I am back with JR Design Sessions number three with me, yours truly, Jonathan Rose. And today I'm going to show you how you can take some great pictures of fireworks and blend them together using Photoshop. Stick around. Now, a few things to keep in mind going forward when you're out there shooting fireworks. Absolutely critical, use a tripod. That way you can just pick the composition that you want and you can just keep shooting basically the same image over and over um, that will give you, you know, captures, several different captures of the same fireworks because oftentimes they don't all appear they, they'll all appear roughly in the same place so you can just get the composition you want and just keep shooting these images that I have taken here um, were all captured at about seven to eight second exposures and that's that's enough to capture the burst and the tails from a lot of the explosions from the fireworks themselves um, and in addition it also makes it a lot easier when you go to try and stack these multiple images in Photoshop and they will all essentially be in the same composition and it, it just makes it a lot easier and I'm going to close this file and we're just gonna start from scratch and when you're out there shooting you're gonna come back with however many images you want I'm gonna show you the just with three how you can do this um, but you can you can do this as many times um, as you as you would want using more than three images and like anything else in Photoshop, there is more than one way to do this, what I'm trying to show you. This is just one way that can get you the results that you might be looking for. So as you can see, these are the three images I have um, that I took over the weekend actually at up in Michigan at near the uh, Mackinac Bridge. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to close all these images. And what I found is that it's instead of trying to open them up and then bring them all into a single Photoshop file let Photoshop do the work for you so all you have to do is go under file and choose scripts and go down here to load files into stack and what that's going to do is it's going to bring up a, a dialog box where you can choose the photos that you want to put in your um, your firework composite basically so I've got the four images here basically there's one firework two firework three firework and I actually have one of just the background with no firework going off so I will choose those four images click OK and you'll see they line up here in the dialog box I won't choose any of these settings I'll just click OK and let Photoshop do the work for me and that will blend or bring them all essentially into one Photoshop file and you can see they're all layered here accordingly and what I can do is I will turn this layer off and this layer off this was the background image that I took with currently no firework in there I will put that one on the bottom and I will turn all the other ones back on and all you have to do really to get those multiple fireworks all in the same photo is just change something in Photoshop called the blend mode of each layer now blend modes are listed right up here right above the layer stack itself and if you click on that pull drop down menu there is a series of options to choose from this series in here definitely makes your images darker this next series down here makes them lighter and this next series down here they sort of get a mixture of both light and dark depending on the sorts of colors that are in your photos and I'll go into that in a different video but for right now we're just going to use a one single blend mode on all of these photos so I'm just going to click on the first image in the layer stack and I'm going to change that blend mode to lighten and when I do that it brings the firework that's in the photo beneath that one through so you can see it now I'm going to choose the second one in the layer stack do the same thing go back up to the blend modes and choose lighten and that brings another one through 
click on the third image normal set it to lighten and there now we have all of those fireworks in one single image one two three great right that works awesome I hope you guys enjoyed that get out there shooting in the next week bring your tripod set your camera to take seven to eight second exposures shoot in manual mode with the same white balance and you'll be good to go once again this has been JR design sessions number three I'm Jonathan Rose if you like what you see here subscribe to my channel thanks for watching and we'll see you next time